Hi everyone, it is Saturday, September 26th. I'm the Yorkie Mom and I'm doing a pup day on a new litter. And you can hear the whimpering. It's behind the camera. I've got the camera on the crate that Mama's in. She's wanting her babies, but I'm going to show you my Blue Merles litter. And I'm going to show you the non Merles. I'll start with the little girl. She is a black. Look at her. She does have a little sable on her. It's very faint. Look at here. Let's show you her face. Isn't she pretty? Look at her new body. Sweet little girl. She is a sweetie pie. And that's the little girl. And there's four. And out of her and this next one, they don't show Merle. But what I've done for the litter is I'm doing color testing and also testing the non merles for the Merle gene with Animal Genetics in Tallahassee, Florida. So I will have all those results back hopefully within the next you know five days or so. The second one's a little boy, he's chocolate. Isn't he pretty? Got a little face. Oh, you show your little hand. Fat. And yes, I did their tails and dew claws. And so we sent that's what we sent in, and plus a, a blood swab when we did the um, tails and dews. And see the little white foot and his feet. There are some indicators there. So I'm not positive about how the gene works with Yorkies. So I just went ahead and paid for the testing. Better to be safe than sorry. But look at how beautiful he is. He's a nice little boy. He's got some small ears, I think. There's him. And then the next ones are my Merles. And I'll show you the boy. He has got some sl slight traditional markings, I think, in him. I don't know. I mean, the Merle goes all the way down. I would think it's the traditional looks like right in here. See how that looks? Yes. Oh. That is an actual um, self-defense reaction, is the yawning. They'll open their mouths as a way to protect themselves. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Here's his markings. They're really pretty. You see that? Show you his back. So you can see I'm trying to be real careful. In there. See the back. Your side. Let's get you turned around, sweet baby. Wee. Here's the other side. Yes, oh goodness. That's the boy. And then the last one is a girl, and I'm absolutely keeping this girl. Oh, she's a full. She is completely full suit, Merle. No traditional on her. See that? All the way down here. Oh. All the way down. Merle all the way down to her feet. Yes, I know. Really nice markings. I like those markings on her. There's a little face. A little neat head. And there's her. So it's those four babies. I won't be doing anything with them regarding pricing or anything until they are no less than four to six weeks old. It could be seven weeks before I determine a price because when it comes to babies, they all have that typical baby look. Some may have a longer face, some may have a shorter face, but even sometimes as they get older, um, when you see the smooth bodies, you can't really tell right now exactly how their coat quality is going to be or how long they're going to be because as they develop over the first couple of weeks they could end up developing just a nice short copy body they may have just standard silk coats and they might even have longer faces they might keep shorter faces they might end up with long rabbit ears they might keep nice little small ears um, they may have super thick coats they may have thin coats they may have cotton coats they may have wiry coats so it's always good for um, a breeder to wait and not just jump the gun and, and price their puppies right out the door per se 
Um, so I want everyone, when I determine everything on these dogs, I take every factor into consideration and I want the puppies looking their absolute best. I want them to shine and sparkle and the uh, potential family to see exactly what they're going to be getting for their investment. But I am tickled to death with, this is my first Yorkie Merle litter. The camera's kind of shaking because I have the camera on my girl's crate. So <laughs> she's getting antsy. She wants her babies. So um, just keep keep a lookout for my pup dates every week as these babies get bigger. I've got to go because she wants her babies back. You folks have a great weekend. Bye-bye.